In this video, I will show you how to install Pandoc on Ubuntu installed on WSL Windows Subsystem for Linux. Pandoc is a tool for converting documents written in one markup format to another format. It is a tool developed by Haskell by Professor John McLaurin of the University of California, Berkeley. There are quite a lot of supporting formats, including Markdown, HTML, LaTeX, EPUB, PDF, etc. Here we'll assume that uh, you will convert the Markdown format file to PDF format and install it. Pandoc's superiority is that you can directly write LaTeX syntax into Markdown format files. Of course, in order to realize this, LaTeX must also be installed, so I will introduce this method as well. In addition, for bibliography and cross-reference functions, we are going to install additional tools, Pandoc Sideproc and Pandoc Crossref. Since this video is supposed to create PDF files in Japanese, if you want to create PDF files of other languages, you do not need a language package or you need to incorporate a different language package. That point in advance please acknowledge. For an overview and grammar of Pandoc, please refer to reference of narration reference file. First of all, execute sudo apt update and sudo apt upgrade beforehand to update the system. Then type sudo apt install pandoc to install pandoc. Next we are going to install pandoc siteproc. Type sudo apt install pandoc siteproc. Next we are going to install tech. Type sudo apt install techlib ratech. Next, install the package related to each language. In this case, Japanese is assumed, but in other languages, install the corresponding language packages if necessary. We will skip this process. Type sudo apt install techlib ztech techlib blank Japanese. Next install Haskell. This depends on Pandoc itself being developed by Haskell. Type sudo apt install Haskell platform. Next, install the two cable to install Pandoc Crosslev. Type sudo apt install cable install. 
Next, we will obtain the cable related update information. Type sudo cable update. Next, install bundle cross crosslet using cable. Type sudo cable install dash dash global bundle crosslet. Please note that global option has been added here. Since bundle crosslet is used as a filter, this specification is requ required. This process takes a considerable amount of time. Next, we are going to create a folder for Pandoc. First, type cd slash mount slash c from the command line and move to Windows C drive. Next, type ls and display the contents of C drive. It's OK. Next, create a directory for Pandoc in a specific directory. Here, we created a directory named Pandoc in the underscore underscore my prg directory. Go to this Pandoc directory and the type code dot to start Visual Studio code. Since this time, we will have to up to the bibliography list, we need to download the style in advance. First, open GitHub styles site in the browser. That URL is github.com citation style language slash styles. Click on Chicago author date.csl in this to display the data and copy all the rows. Return to VS Code. Create a new Chicago author date.csl file and paste it into it. Save this file. Next, we are going to create a bib file for bibliography. In this Example, I created a new file myref01.bib. We are going to write the literature information here. For the notation, see reference. Next, we are going to create a sample data for testing in Markdown format. Here, I created it as a sample01.md file.
Next, we are going to compile with pandoc, but since it is necessary to specify so many parameters, I decided to write a script for node.js. Create a file called makepdf01.js and describe the proce processing process here. In addition, since this source was uploaded to GitHub, so please see it for details. Next, run makepdf01.js from the command line. Type node makepdf01.js sample01. When compilation is completed, a new sample01.pdf file is generated. On the BS code, Start the file explorer and display this PDF file. A PDF file was created and the table of contents was also created. Each link is also functional. A bibliography list is also generated. Up to this point, compile with Pandoc using Node.js was possible, but even if Node.js is not installed, you can also compile directly with Pandoc by specifying many parameters on the command line. In that case, Pandoc sample02.md dash show sample02.pdf dash b document class equal ltga article dash pdf dash engine equal ruatec ruatec dash dash toc dash bibliography equal myref one.bib dash csl chicago author date.csl dash filter pandoc cross left we are going to try to actually enter the pdf engine name was wrong fix this and restart restart it This time, the extension of mark uh, sample02 was insufficient. Fix this and restart it. It's okay. Sample02.pdf has been generated. We are going to display this file.
It's okay. Thank you for your watching.